Hello everybody, my name is Shadbra and today we'll be playing Riddle School 2. Riddle to School. School 2 Riddle. Which is obviously a sequel to the first Riddle School. And um, let's dive right in. John Burrow presents. Mm -hmm. <gasps> I thought. Zzz, bees face plant and then his eyes started floating again whatever all right okay what is this did anyone else notice that the base symbol is backwards <gasps> that's the band director mr obo he only got hired because of his name go figure i know nothing of music but much of english what the band director wrote yesterday to admit to us the non-musical truth even though his his the e in english is lowercase when it should be uppercase whatever that's zach who is always very very cold i wonder why he never wears more than one sweater good point that's smiley she's the only one around who likes school let's see hey fred can you help me escape school again I have a whistle, as if that'd be useful. It might help. Can I have it? Only if you have a dollar. Well, what are these shiny things? <gasps> Quarter. Quarter. Oh, that's an I didn't trace drum set. The creator of this game probably had trouble drawing it. Well, it looks like a very nice drum set, I must say. Another quarter, another quarter. Easy. Here's my whistle for that dollar you got there. I don't actually use it anyway. Well, if you don't use it, then why did you uh, make us give you a dollar, you jerk? Oh, yeah, well. Here's your first whistle back, Fred. I don't feel like stealing music from you at the moment. Oh, sweet burn there. Oh, he's frozen solid, poor guy. That was a shop idea. Can't believe I said that. Just like the last game. It's the bell it rings when school ends. I don't recall doing that recently. Sick burn to the school. I can't get out. I'll bet the counselor at the school has the keys like last time. All I need to do is to 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 do is get to his office, grab the keys and make my escape. Obviously, this is probably easier said than done. Unless, of course, you are mute. Hmm, let's go to the janitor's closet. Hmm? What are you... What are you doing down here? Ah, oh, let's check the lockers. Ah, oh, there's... <gasps> Ten cents right there. Easy peasy. The door is locked and the lights are off. <gasps> let's go to the women's room. Oh, no. Okay. I break. I don't break for ducks. There aren't many ducks around here and I can't drive yet. You are in middle school, so that would make sense. The door is locked and the lights... Ah, oh, okay, same thing. Let's go to the men's room. Um, does anyone out there have toilet paper? Uh, no, I do not. Those sinks are awesome because there's soap in the water that comes out of them. That is pretty awesome, I must say. Oh, I want a cookie. Just a cookie, nothing else. <gasps> That's Chubb. He's on the National Obesity Observer's Top 5 Most Wanted list. Probably won't need that. The only fire the school's ever had was when Zack sneezed all over that science project. Riddle School 2, oh wow, they made a second one? Awesome! I'll have to check it out once I escape school. There's a roll of toilet paper in that vent? Who sticks toilet paper in... Yeah, the same. Same question that I have. I would go in and get it with a vent covers rusted shut. <gasps> Teacher's lounge in the hallway and I thought I might stop by. It's very nice of you, but this is... That's very nice of you, but this is the teacher's lounge! Get out! Why are you here? Hmm. Got permission to buy a cookie. When did teacher sent you in here? Mr. Obo. Do you have a note? I didn't think so! Get out! Hmm. Try... Is she asleep? She has! She's been asleep since last month! Hmm. Dawn. 
this, this, um... That's me! And I never said you could have a cookie go back to class! Hmm, let's try. I just saw a cow in the office randomly burst into flames. <gasps> was it my cow? What did it look like? It was fat and white with black spots. My cow just have spots, so that story is no concern of mine! Get out! Hmm, let's try this one. Actually, I'm not sure whether or not it was a cow. That doesn't convince me the story's true. I didn't sound that believable to begin with. If you don't have anything useful to say, it's just that you get back to class. Hmm. Still want that cookie, huh? Well... Let's go to Mrs. Sleep's classroom. That's Mrs. Sleep's computer. It was in sleep mode until someone unplugged it. That's Mrs. Sleep. She hasn't moved since last month. Till we find someone to drag her out of the room and replace her, she's here to stay. It's kind of boring, but at least we don't have to do any work. That's true. Don't feel blue. Insignificant posters, huh? Look on the bright side. Those are encouraging posters. You should not say that they are insignificant. Isn't that interesting? She stopped at the letter Z. It's a vent. Yum yum. Hmm, this desk is open. I think my trombone slide oil could be of use, and I'll bring my 30 cents along just in case. Hmm, I have an idea. Let's use this with that trombone slide oil for the toilet paper. Now let's go to the men's room. Yes, I do have toilet paper. What can I say except you're welcome? All right, now we have a mop. So let's go to the janitor's closet and exchange it for something. Here you go. <gasps> Wait. Did you find my mop? I've been looking all over for it. Thanks for returning it. Here's my last dime. Don't waste it on the school's cheesy pencils. Hmm, so how many, how much money do we have? 20, 25, 50 cents. Not too bad, I must say. Go to the teacher. <gasps> now it's empty, the teacher's lounge is empty. It's a green sofa. I used to have a green sofa. That was before my dog ate the whole thing while I was sleeping. Coffee machine, it reminds me of my old teacher, Mrs. Kofi. She shook so much from her coffee that her classroom started crumbling apart. Mmm, it's a picture of an apple. Rather eat a real apple than stare at a picture of one. Yeah, same. It's a cobweb. I sold one of those at a garage sale for $10. Not bad, kid. Hmm. Well, it doesn't appear to be functional, so... Let's see if it, there's like a plug or an outlet, huh? Well, that was easy. Let's see. To get a cookie, we must have 75 cents. Need to come back later when I have the money. Hmm. So we have 50 cents right now. So that would... Let's let's go check. And here, have a nice visit while you are here, and hurry back to class when you're finished. Well, thank you. On the plus side, get it? Ah, oh, that actually made you laugh. You have a terrible sense of humor, sir. That's not even funny. One plus two equals the square root of nine. That's very true. Three. Let's see. It's called a pie chart because 3.14% of the people said pumpkin pie was their favorite. Pumpkin pie is also my favorite. I love it. That's Mr. Sam's calculator. I can see why he would need it since all he does is simple addition. And are they... Oh, well. I guess that's uh, that's another coin, huh? I think we, uh, we might have the 75 cents now to get our beloved cookie. Oh, yes, I think we do. <gasps> Cookie! Don't eat it, it's for Mr. Chubster here. <gasps> oh, he wants that cookie. 
Oh, he makes Cookie Monster look like a cookie hater. That's five. Yes, that's his name. He won a school election a few years ago with his fi vote five shirt. None of the five cabinets are unlocked. It's a bowling ball. Yes, it is. Smiley face! Mr. Mister. Hello there. Suck, bruh. <gasps> I'm keeping this! I think he took the key. Let's go apologize to Mr. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Let's uh, get out of here on the contrary. <gasps> Hallelujah! Freedom! Real School 2. Directed by John Bro. Programmed by John Bro. Drawn animated by John Bro. Oh yeah! That was a fun game. It's one of those games you can just kind of complete in one afternoon, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Well, that was fun. Awesome. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. And uh, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, whatever you need to do. I will see you guys next time.